Hey everyone, I'm Laurencio, and in this video I'm going to talk about all Hooked games for the Nintendo Wii. Hooked got really bad reviews from both critics and the gamer community. Is it really that bad? Yeah, yeah, kinda. But it's still playable. You control the hook with the Wiimote and the nunchuck, you can throw the bait in three different ways, there are some lakes you can fish in, and some lures, but the content you get is still limited. The music indeed is annoying, but I can't really judge as I don't like the music in any fishing game anyway, but that didn't hinder me to enjoy those good fishing games. And anyway, the music is annoying. Overall, it's a game that you get easily bored by. It doesn't have enough content and the one you get is poorly executed that you will play something else in no time. Not because the game is broken, but because it doesn't hook you. And hooked again, depending how you pronounce it, can be a good game or a bad game. For those who enjoyed the game, and yes, there are people who enjoyed the game, because it isn't terrible, it's just dull anyway, any game is playable and can be fun with friends. If you play it with friends, any game can be fun. Anyway, the second hooked game is improved. You get more lakes and more fish, the controls have been improved, they don't feel unresponsive anymore, just clumsy. And the underwater life is more animated now. In the other one you felt many times that the fish were just some floating cardboard and not actual fish. Overall the game, hooked again, has more content, it has refined controls and if you were to choose between hooked and hooked again, definitely get hooked again. Though I don't recommend you play any of the two games. Sure, they have tournaments and multiple lures and stuff, but you'll see that when you actually get to play the games, you are going to get bored easily by the games, as the execution is kinda poor, even for a fishing game. 